I just want to officially welcome you all. Um, it is so special to be here with you all, even in this virtual world. And I'm so happy to see so many of your all's names popping up. I said this on senior celebration day, but this, this looks so different than we could have ever imagined it to look for you all, but that doesn't mean it can't still be special and meaningful. And the fact that you all continue to choose to show up for it tells me that these celebrations are going to be amazing and I promise you will never forget them. So thank you for being here first and foremost. Um, I do want to give a couple of quick reminders before we get into um, the official stuff. So Ms. Dissing mentioned um, these things at the very beginning, but just make sure you are in speaker view right now, um, which means that it should probably just be my big old face on your computer screen. If you're seeing lots of little boxes, you're in gallery view. And if you're seeing lots of little boxes, just go up to that upper right hand corner um, and it'll give you the option to click it over to speaker view. So you want to be in speaker view. And then the second thing is that we are recording this. So if you do have a technology glitch or you get logged out or something like that, don't panic. We will send you guys the link later so that you're able um, to watch and get caught up on everything. Um, and then my last reminder is uh, just a request to please keep reading your school emails. Um, if you could just check in at least once a day, read those emails, at least for the next couple of weeks, because we still have lots of celebrating to do with you all. And that might mean sometimes we need to get information to you, and it might mean sometimes we need information from you. So uh, email is going to be the easiest and best way for us to continue to communicate with you. So please read those emails. So on to the good stuff, out of the business stuff. Um, part of what we wanted to do for you all today is to, to frame a little bit the history of lockout day and what it means and what its purpose is. So you all already know that it's been a tradition for many years of assumption that on the last day of classes, um, seniors do walkout day. And what that usually means is that a few minutes before um, classes end for the day, um, we turn, uh, we get on the PA, Ms. Tedesco comes over, um, we pull Forever Young up onto the speakers, we play it, and all together, the seniors leave their classrooms, they walk through those halls, and they exit the doors at 2170 Tyler Lane um, for that final time as students. Uh, you've seen that happen before. You've been part of that because you've watched the seniors from the years before go through that process. So that's the part that I know you already know. The part that I'm thinking you may not know is the part that I actually didn't even know until um, last week when I was having a conversation with Ms. Tedesco and Mrs. Schumann about the history of walkout day and how it got started. So the very first class to do walkout day as we know it was the class of 1999. And um, it really made me laugh hearing how it came about because it wasn't a long planned process with lots of careful thought into it. It actually was kind of an accident that walkout day started how it did. So what had actually been planned is that the faculty and staff thought it would be fun to all dress in khaki and white and see how long it took the students to notice. Um, so it just meant to be a very simple, silly prank, nothing all that spectacular, just a little gentle humor for that last day of school. Um, and the seniors noticed for sure. They saw the khaki and white, they picked up on it, and then they became convinced that the khaki and white was just a sign of something really big and amazing that the faculty and staff had planned for them later in the day. But like I said, the faculty and staff hadn't planned anything beyond just wearing that khaki and white that day. But they really didn't want to disappoint the seniors. So they made a scramble as the school day went on and they spent lunch block um, figuring out what song they were going to play and then printing and cutting out cards with the lyrics to Forever Young on them. And then they came over the speakers the last few minutes of the school day and a tradition was born. So that really made me, <laughs> made me laugh a lot because I did realize that it hadn't been this carefully thought out um, plan and that we really do good stuff at the last minute when we have to be creative. Um, and I know when we think back to the years, the 20 years of students who have done that and how special it has been and how you all have looked forward to this moment. Um, you know, I know we're all a little heartbroken that we can't do that for you today. 
that we can't send you out of our classrooms, physically see you walk out of the building. Um, you all deserve to walk out of the school for sure. And we, your faculty and staff, deserve to see you do it. Um, this is a hard moment in some ways because we're missing that so much. Um, but the thing that makes me smile as I think about all of that is the connection that there is. The thing that goes underneath all of this is the love that existed for that very first walkout tradition and the love that we have for you all today. Because that first walkout for the class of 1999 was just our faculty and staff pinch hitting at the last second, trying to come up with some kind of plan so they didn't disappoint those seniors they loved so much. And this is us this year, your faculty and staff pinch hitting in this world that we could not have imagined and trying to come up with a plan so we don't disappoint you all, the seniors that we love so much. Um, and I just love the creativity that comes out of all of that. And I hope that you can feel the love that goes into these um, events and things that we are doing for you all because we do love you and we want it to be special. Um, this day too has always been just a really unique one. Um, we love, of course, all of our graduation events are special. Senior Honors Assembly, Baccalaureate, Graduation. We love those. That trio of events is just a fun, uplifting, happy celebration for all of us. But walkout day has always been extra special to the faculty and staff because it's the day that we don't have to share our goodbye with anyone else. It's just you and us. And that has always been the best part of it for us. And so even though we're not having the opportunity to do this day the way we have done before and to give you those hugs outside of Tyler Lane doors like we normally would, um, there was nothing that was going to stop us from finding some special way to say goodbye to the class of 2020. Um, and so I'm really pleased to be able to share with you all a letter that the faculty and staff have written from our hearts to yours. Dear class of 2020. You have demonstrated what it means to be a rocket to your classmates and underclasswomen time and time again throughout your years at Assumption. I am so proud of your commitment to compassion and for the Christian leaders you have become. Your diversity in your interests, backgrounds, and convictions is what unites you. It makes you one of the most interesting classes I have ever learned from. Thank you for every word you spoke and every action you took that brought the loving, inclusive reign of God alive in our community. Your strength, your grace, and your leadership will forever leave a mark on Assumption. Class of 2020, you have shown that you love God and your neighbor as yourself. You are women, you are writers, and you have integrity. And I expect you to use that integrity now and always. Thank you for being the best leaders and role models for your underclass women sisters. From now on, when I think of grace under pressure, strength of spirit, spirit of connection across the miles, and generous loving hearts, I will always, always think of the class in 2020. Como dice Billy, las quiero para siempre. Mis primeras sophomores de Assumption. Anyone can lead down an existing path, but what I love about the class of 2020 is that you courageously and confidently blaze the new trail through woods we've never entered before. Remember, you are far too fabulous to settle for a mediocre life. You always made me smile when you stopped by my classroom to say hi and see how my day was going. From the song by Leanne Womack, when you get the choice to sit it out or dance, I hope you dance. Stand up straight, keep your weight on both feet, and use your voice. I am so blessed to have gotten to know many of you in my first year at Assumption. Thank you for being so kind and welcoming. I will never forget you all because I think you're the only class whose motto was not only prophetic, but also one that you owned and you lived. 
from the late, great Casey Kasem. Keep your feet on the ground and keep reaching for the stars. Remember, you will always have a home on Tyler Lane. You've heard me say it so many times this year, but you are the G-O-A-T. <laughs> it's a big world out there, my dear Rose, and you are ready for it. Your excellence on the field, court, and courses, in the theaters, and in all competitions were truly impressive. Have courage and be kind during this difficult time and know we're behind you. Always remember, home is where the heart is and the class of 2020 holds a very special place in my heart. Every good heroine shows her mettle by overcoming obstacles. Good job, ladies. You are resilient women. I will miss your noise, your hallway hellos, our conversations before class, and yes, even that constant chatter during class. So please come back and visit so we can hear your voice again. As you will soon become an alumna of Assumption, we hope you remain engaged with your alma mater and come back and visit. As you all approach a very bright future, the limit does not exist. You embody all that assumption is, and I know you will carry assumption with you and share it with others wherever you may go. So how is it that the class who lost the most turned out to be our greatest source of hope and inspiration when we needed it most? What a legacy. To the precious class of 2020, remember to stay strong, stay positive, and know you can handle whatever comes your way. When you remember your time at Assumption, your sisters, teachers, and staff are with you wherever you go. No one's ever truly gone. Enjoy the little things in life. For one day, you may look back and realize they were the big things. Always be the uniquely and wonderfully made you. I'm on a rise trip, senior retreat, and time with my journalism girls. I want to thank the class of 2020 for some of my most precious moments as a teacher. May God grant you the strength and courage to find yourself, to find your path, and to live your life with grace and beauty. Thanks for always letting me take your picture, even when you hate it. I will miss capturing your sweet face and watching you mature through the lens. I love you, class of 2020, and you know you're going to miss my mints. Before you were together 20, you were Ohana, family. You have always seemed to know that together is not a place, but the choice to welcome and love one another. You have made mistakes and you have learned from them. The class of 2020 will always hold a special place in my heart and one that I will never forget. Let your heart be the anchor and the beat of your soul. Thank you for being so welcoming and such great role models for our freshmen this year. You have truly set the example for what the class of 2023 will want to be. Thank you for persevering, for continuing to ask questions when you don't understand, for helping each other out in the chat window, and for doing test corrections even when it didn't get you out of an exam. The world is so lucky to have you in it. Please come back and visit me in the main office because you know I will have a sweet treat waiting for you. Thanks for all of your hard work. It didn't go unnoticed. Nothing brightened my day more than seeing your face in the doorway of my office. My wish for you is that when you look back on your time at Assumption, you won't reflect on what you lost, rather on what you have gained. Faith, compassion, integrity, excellence, community, Love. You are the only one who can be you. So do it the best you can and don't let others change you. You are stronger than you have ever been. So take everything you have learned from Assumption and show the world what it means to lead with faith, compassion, integrity, and excellence. Please come back to visit. You blazed across our lives like a comet. And we are forever saddened that your year was eclipsed. You aren't really leaving Assumption. You're taking Assumption with you wherever you go. 
and you have the ability to assumptionize every community you belong to from here on out. Class of 2020, thank you for sharing your love with us and your beautiful light with us. Keep on shining, ladies. Thank you for all the time you shared with me in the AC. Whether you were serving as a peer tutor or just getting a little help with homework, you always made my day a little happier. Thank you for making me a better athletic director, a better coach, and ultimately a better person. In the words of Jason Mraz, just know that wherever you go, you can always come home. Go ye now in peace. As you walk the road of life from this place, remember that no problem leads you where you found it. And until we meet again, may you keep safe in the gentle, loving arms of God. We know this is hard, but just remember this isn't the end, but a new beginning. We are so very proud of you, and we know you will do great things. We love you. We will miss you. Hand over heart. We hope you enjoyed that special, well, we know we did from the chat, uh, letter from the faculty and staff. And that's not anything we've ever done for any other class. So we wanted to do that really special thing for you, but we also wanted to give you a little bit of the traditional experience as well. So you know from past experience that as Ms. Asphalt said, I usually come on the announcements at the end of the day and I say this message. First I say, at this time, we would like to honor our seniors since this is their last full day of classes. Then I send all the underclass women out into the hallway so that I can talk to just you, just the class of 2020. So it's time. It's just us and all of our faculty and staff. And here's our message for you. We want you to know it's been a pleasure teaching and knowing you. Your class has been a great role model for the underclass women, and we will miss your enthusiasm and your energy. We want you to leave today and go off into the world and do fabulous things. Please stay connected to the Assumption community though. We want you to work, our alumni, work with our alumni association, help with events and activities, lead retreats, and come back to events and performances. And we hope that you'll continue to support Assumption after you leave so that there will be many future Rockets who will have the opportunity to have the experience that you have had the past four years. Most importantly, know that wherever you go, we go with you. And know that once you are an Assumption Rose, you are always a Rose. And most importantly, know that you can always come home. If you ever need anything, please let us know. You are forever a part of the community of Assumption. Lastly, we'd like to leave you with these final words from the song, Forever Young. Please listen to the words and know that these are, your, are our hopes for you. After the song, we will invite you to participate in a final goodbye to your faculty and staff. One more time, we love you, we miss you. Know that you are forever young, forever a rocket, forever a rose, hand over heart.
Oh, goodness. <laughs> um, am I up on the screen here? Yes. Okay. I can't tell on my end for some reason. Okay. Didn't think about having to go after that video. <laughs> you sweet babies all grown up. It is so crazy to watch those old, old pictures and know where you are today. Um, this is just awesome. I don't know why we don't do a big video like that every year. Um, but we love you all so, so, so much. Um, and of course, we cannot let you get off the Zoom call until we get to see each and every one of your faces. So one at a time, I'm going to ask each family to turn their cameras and their microphones on and give us a wave and a smile. But in order for that to actually work and happen, um, I'm going to give you all a few technology instructions here. Um, so first, I need everybody to go up to the top right corner of their screen and you want to switch over to gallery view. So that might just be a waffle. But when you click it, it's going to show you lots of little little boxes of people's names in them instead of just my face. So I'll give everyone a chance to do that real quick. All right. And then, um, is anybody having trouble? If you're having trouble, say I'm having trouble in the chat. But I feel like you guys understand how Zoom works. So hopefully everyone's in gallery view now. Um, so then as I call your family name, what you're going to do so this will work is click, uh, click the video icon down in the bottom left corner and unmute yourself. And then you're going to wave, but you also have to say something, say hello, or make some noise so that your face pops on to the main screen for all of us. Um, and then, so I will call for a whole family to turn their videos and sound on together. We'll say hello, we'll wave, we'll have a moment, and I'll ask you to turn them back off. And then I just ask that you guys keep them off when they're supposed to be off and on when they're supposed to be on. Because otherwise, we won't get to see everybody, and that's what we want. So, um, with that being said, I'm going to go ahead and get things started with Family Bird. Hi guys. Hi. My camera's broken. Hi. 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 I wish my camera wasn't so messed up. Congratulations, <laughs> girls. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Good luck to all of you. We love you. God I love you all. <laughs> okay. Bye, family burr. Bye. Bye. Love you guys. Bye. Back off. Bye. Man, that was... So awesome. I know it feels a little awkward to just be shouting at the camera, but you guys, that was just amazing to see your all's faces. So up next is Family Booters Town. Turn those cameras on. Turn your mics on. Tell us hello. Hey, everyone. Hey. 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 Oh, my God. Hey. Hey. I love you all. Hello. I love you guys. Hey, I so much. Hey, love you. Hey, love you. love you. too. love you. love you guys. All right, you guys turn your cameras and mics back off. And then up next we have family carlo turn those videos and microphones on and say hello oh. hi. 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 we love you guys hello love you all you all i miss you all oh. love you all Aww, bye, 
All right, next up we have Charleville. Turn those cameras and microphones on. Hi. Hi, Hi everybody. Hi. 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 Loves in my life. Love you all. So much. Love you guys. Love you, love you guys. <laughs> well, love you all, Charleville. Next up, we have Family Cork. Hi. 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 Hello. Hi. 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 <laughs> what do you say? I love you I'm watching your picture. Smile. Oh, <laughs> you ain't corking, you ain't corking. Spore the retinas. Spore the retinas. Save the retinas. Save the retinas, ladies. Love you all, Cork. I love you all. Love you I love you all. all. Bye. 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 All right, up next we have Galway. Hello. 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 Oh my god. faces um just the best really i didn't think this is the part that was gonna make me cry <laughs> um so just like in walkout days in the past we always have some students who are ready to go <laughs> and then we have some who like to linger for forever and you may linger as long as you would like today there's no rush you can stay and chat with each other you can turn videos and cameras on do whatever you want and when you're ready, you're going to click that button to leave the meeting and do your final senior sign-off. But I want you to remember the words that Ms. Tedesco has said on our behalf so often. We love you. We miss you. 
hand over heart. I love you all. Love you all. Miss you. Hope everyone. Love you. Us. I miss all of you guys. I love you, guys. you all so much. I love everyone. I so much. Love you all so much. I love you guys. 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 Be safe out there. I will be kind of looking for you guys, you know. Morgan and Bridget. Yeah, why not? Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday, Morgan and Bridget.
I was really strong. Oh, come on, guys. Oh, I wasn't emotion like very emotional at all, and now look at me. <laughs> I didn't think I could cry anymore. Me neither. Oh, I, was, I was gonna cry <laughs> during this moment. But we were there physically. I was bawling. I, yeah, I was there. Anna, I'm your mic. Anna, I'm your mic. Marty. Hi. I miss you. I miss you, Marty. Mar, Marjani, I miss you more than any other girlfriend. Okay, you know what? I want to come down here, have a lion's visit, and even if I need to come here, I'm glad I'm by everybody's house. We also have no, we also have a that? big get together over the summer. Like yes, once more, please. Summer. I need to. Yeah. Need to. Only if, it's, only if the social distancing guidelines no, are up, we're not no, getting no. it down. Caroline, I want to miss a second. No, I'm not saying that. I hope I had to say it. Come on. Oh my God. <laughs> That's fair yeah. there. Oh. <laughs> I will not be abiding by any social distancing if we get together. I will be hugging everyone. I'll take Corona. Feelings need hugs. Rachel, love you. I love you too. I don't know who said that, but I love you. <laughs> Tessa, I love you. I love you, Rachel. I love you guys. I love you all so much. Leanna, I miss you in our public speaking. I miss you, Grinchy. I miss you. Katie, Katie, Katie. Oh, Rachel, Kevin. Mary, you getting active. I wish you guys would say your names. I can't look at all your faces. <laughs> yeah, you can. Just get a kick. Uh, you gotta click the multi screen thing. That's I'm on nice. my phone. Oh. Yeah, oh I yeah, that didn't so help. Sad. Mary. I think somebody left me at home. So what is Mary doing? <laughs> Mary, what you doing? <laughs> Work it out. Don't try that so fun. <laughs> I love you. Bye. I love you all. Caitlin, that's so I love fun. You, Abigail. You. Yes, I'm sorry. I'm Abigail. so glad I got to be friends with everyone. Yeah. Dude, Aww. remember the time in Anatomy and Physiology, always with Mr. Brown? Yes. And I Anna, too? Him. I miss Mr. Brown. I miss Mr. Brown. <laughs> Caroline, I miss you just hanging out at lunch sometimes because you would just not go back to class. Oh, man. That's <laughs> not true for the teachers that are listening. Oh, I was in study. Not, <laughs> not skipping class. Alex, Alex. I, I hope everyone Alex. likes my dancing. Bye, guys. I love you guys. Perfect. I very much I did. I love you. Oh, my gosh. Oh, I'm out here. I can at least make one song about assumption that's good. I could probably make a world record for us. The you class know, of 2020. Yes. Do it. Do it, Marty. I'm looking to it, Marty. I'm looking forward to it. It's so weird that, like, around this time, we would be always like, coming out of school soon. I miss you. Crazy. You must be no. Oh, my God. Am I doing it wrong? We do. I feel like I'm like, 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 Oh, you do a little like, hard. Like, house. 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 Jenny, Marty. Jenny, oh, I love you so much. I love you all. Yes. Oh my God, I love, 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 love you. Shayna, I love you and I miss you. Shayna, I love you too. Oh my God, Hi, Shayna, I love you. I miss you. Oh, hey. I love you, you so much. You all look at yourself in the camera right now and think about Peace out, lovers. I miss you. I love you, and I will forever call you my sisters. I can't wait to kiss you. Maria. I love you all. Bye. Love you all. I love you. I love you guys. Should we leave on the couch? Love you all. Because we're never going to leave. Yeah, I don't want to leave. They should kick us off. Yeah, I don't think I'm ever going to be able to leave. We should wait until two fifty-five and then leave at two fifty-five. That's the end of the school day. 
Okay, yeah, let's leave it 255. I'll leave it 255. That's the end of the school day. Nobody's home bothering me now. One last time at 255. Do you think it's only last an hour? Do they kick you off? I don't think so. Because kind of anti sitting here You can stay as long as you want, Livy. Nobody's kicking you off. You can stay as long as you want. Schumann, I miss you. We miss you. I miss you guys. Oh, God. We miss you. I have a headache. Thank you so much. I don't think I've ever cried so hard. My face hurts. Big, ugly cry. Me too, yeah. My face hurts like smiling and it really sucks. Hi, Madeline. It's so bad. It's so bad. They're just like, I'm like sweating. Hi, doggy. Skylar, I hate you. Oh, Grace is wearing her own here. She left. Skylar. How many people Every time I from you, I thought you were yeah. awesome since we sit, sat next to each other and helped. Go! I, I love you, Gracie. <laughs> I think I have my own. Gracie, you my always head. helped me in health. Oh, I wouldn't have done it without you. <laughs> Skylar, you literally have my whole heart. Like, I love you. Skylar was my first friend at a school. Oh my gosh, Skylar, please stop. Please stop. Skylar, do you remember we sat next to each other and study? Oh my god, I know you. Of course. And in English. I would break your hair all the time, girl. Let's keep fangirling over Skylar, guys. Tessie, I love you. I love you all so much. I love you, Tessie, so much. Daddy. My daddy. Jenny. Tessie, you were my queen. Jenny. Goddess, she's rocking it. Oh, hell, Jessie. Jenny, it was me, Jenny. You're so adorable. Look at her. Jenny, oh, you're like, so you're so cute. Jenny's you're like my our favorite. Little, like, the little mascot. Oh, thank you. I can't oh, blush. Yeah. That would be. <laughs> you can't blush? Hi. <laughs> Hi. Is that Skylar saying that? Yes. Hi. I just thought I missed freshman treat. Oh, I know. That was the, I love that leading retreat. It's so cute. Leading retreat is so fun. I'm hoping to come back and do it. Me too. Oh, it so awesome. I want to do that too. I want to come yeah. back and lead a retreat. I'll do it as many times so just to see every, each one of you. Can I put in that right now? <laughs> retreat that's just all class of 20 liters. That would be really, really hard to do, Marty. <laughs> <laughs> uh, I'm going to try. I'm going to try without <laughs> giving up. It. Hey, hey, we've got prom and graduation in July. So, yeah. Oh, so, okay, graduation in July. When is prom? Prom is in July too. Tentatively, mm -hmm. it depends on it depends on where we are in terms of the social distancing guidelines. Yeah, this is like a oh, temporary yeah. reschedule. It's we'll see how it goes. So, and this is a prom dress for tomorrow. If you want to have prom and graduation in July, mm -hmm. please stay home. I'm staying home. I'm fixing up my house. That's why I'm mostly doing Caroline. Please. I'm mostly fixing up the house. I'm begging here. you. Caroline, I promise. Yeah. I'm going to leave because my mom wants to talk to me. Um, So I got to go. But I love you all. I really love you. I love you so much. Riley, I love you. You always make me smile. So and I, I love you, Riley. I love you so much. I'll call you. I'm going to call you. We got, I got two to see <laughs> later on. <laughs> Be calling you, girl. Bye, I love you. Bye. Bye. Oh, this is so, oh, so sad. Mm -hmm. This hurts. Bye. How are you doing? <laughs> <laughs> this is so wow. cute. I miss you all. Aww. I miss you all too. It's just so awkward. I can't it's wait to be so able weird. to hug everyone again. <laughs> you just <laughs> said that. <laughs> it's so awkward just not seeing you guys. Yeah. Oh, yeah. <laughs> I thought you were talking about our conversation, Marty. <laughs> After school, it's gone. <laughs> but at so least I want to hug you guys just so bad. Mm -hmm. just, oh, no. I miss hugging no. you all. No. It's, the classes aren't the same. Like It's just not the same without seeing no. everybody. I need hugs. I know. <laughs> hugs are essential so for me. You Lots in this of class. Hugs. hugs are essential in the, for me in this class, and I need it for every, every one of you. I will have the protective gear that my mom was going to have to buy for me. I will dress up in <laughs> the orange suit if I have to. I'm going to show up at your door and keep me. I'm going to show up in a hazmat suit. Have no, you have no control over it. <laughs> oh, yeah. <laughs> um, my uncle did the backyard, so I'll try to turn the camera on. 
not the backyard. Oh my god, the front yard. <laughs> <laughs> Where do you move back? Oh, have, my sister has the backyard. <laughs> Stop. I'm looking, I'm looking at what? <laughs> okay, can I turn my camera on? How do you do so? Sarah Smith, I haven't doing? seen you in so long. I miss you. Hi, Gracie. I miss you so much. Oh, Charlie, don't together anymore. Oh my god, you all are the cutest. I miss you guys so much. <laughs> Oh, it's so history. And Rachel Cannon, it's been so long since Mission Week. It's been like I know. I was Thank thinking about that the other week. Up. I miss you guys so much. Bye, Rachel. Hi. Oh, that's a nice front yard, Marty. Skylar. <laughs> I know. <laughs> oh, <this room. laughs> it have a freaking um, screen here. Marley, what, what is that? What it took yeah, why do you have that? What a true story. Tell them. What is that? Are you going to I got it on our Rise Mission trip in Oxford. Tell the story. Oh, the nail nail right? What it took to get that oh, nail out of the boards. Look at oh this. My it God. has like ridges. <laughs> five inches long. <laughs> me, Riley, Ella Brown, and this like old strong buff man and we could not get it. I wish yeah, I and fine, like we were trying for like 20 minutes and like using all of our strength and we still couldn't get it. Jerry. Finally. Finally. I have mine too. It's, our, it's on my desk. I would have paid. I was wearing my hand in hand shirt this morning before I changed into my uniform. She went to uh, Cincinnati with me. Oh, I, had the, I had the oh. cowhouse shirt on. Most of my oh. wardrobe in my closet is something I'm wearing. have family down there, yeah. so if anything happens, I could call people up just to protect you, honey, because I know people there. <laughs> I'll, I'll literally, that's only a three hour drive from me. <laughs> Am I in danger? Am I okay? You know, you're good. It's just you can, in certain areas, you want to be careful with if you want to go out of the campus, but it's inclusive, so you can. I'm going to Bellarmine, so I'm good. Oh, I thought you said you were Why am I up to This is a townhouse shirt from Cincinnati. I went to Cincinnati um, on my Arise trip. Okay, who's going to Arizona State with me? Because I think I'm the only one. I'm not sure. <laughs> you're going to Arizona State? Then. Is that, is it Whoa, you? girl, that's far. Cool.